Isa ka ba sa mga batang mahilig sa numbers? O isa ka sa mga natatakot at nahihirapang itindihin ang mga mathematical concepts? Huwag kang mag-alala. Nandito ako para tulungan ka. Ang mathematics ay gagawin natin easy, fun, and exciting with me, Teacher Joyce. Lesson 14, Estimating the Quotient of 3 to 4 Digit Dividends by 1 to 2 Digit Divisor Objective After going through this lesson, you are expected to estimate the quotient of 3 to 4 Digit Dividends by 1 to 2 Digit Divisors Let's take a look on this number We have 3,105 divided by 34, where 3,105 is the dividend and 34 is the divisor. And we have to find the estimated quotient. Step 1 is to round off the dividend and the divisor to the highest place value. 3 is the highest place value in the divisor. To round it off, check the digit to the right of 3. If it is less than 5 or 0 to 4, the digit will remain the same. If it is 5 and above, we will add 1. The digit 1 is less than 5. Therefore, 3 will remain the same. And all the digits to its right will be replaced with 0. 3,104 rounded off to the highest place value is 3,000. Let's round off 34. 3 is the digit in the highest place value and the digit to its right is 4. Since the digit to its right is less than 5 or 0 to 4, the digit 3 will remain the same. So, 34 rounded off to the highest place value is 30. Step 2. Apply the rules of cancellation for dividing rounded numbers. So, the divisor 30 has 1 zeros. So, we will cancel 1 zero in the divisor and the dividend. Step 3. Divide the remaining numbers. You may solve this using the long method. 300 divided by 3. 3 divided by 3 is 1. Then 1 times 3 is equals to 3. 3 minus 3 is equals to 0. Bring down 0. 0 divided by 3 is 0. Then 0 times 3 is equals to 0. 0 minus 0 is 0. Bring down 0. 0 divided by 3 is 0, then 0 times 3 is equals to 0, 0 minus 0 is equals to 0. If you don't want to use the long method, you can simply divide 3 by 3. So 3 divided by 3 is 1, then copy the remaining zeros and you will get the same answer. So, the estimated quotient of 3,105 and 34 is 100. Let's have another example. We have 6,220 divided by 29. Where 6,220 is the dividend, 29 is the divisor, and we have to find the estimated quotient. So step one is to round off the dividend and the divisor to the highest place value. Six is the highest place value in the divisor. So to round it off, check the digit to the right of six. If it is less than five or zero to four, the digit will remain the same. If it is five and above, we will add one. The digit two is less than five. Therefore, the digit 6 will remain the same. And all the digits to its right will be replaced with 0. So, 6,220 rounded off to the highest place value is 6,000. 
Let's round off 29. 2 is the digit in the highest place value and the digit to its right is 9. So we will add 1 to 2. So 2 plus 1 is 3 and the digit to its right will be replaced with 0. So 29 rounded off to the highest place value is 30. Step 2 is to apply the rules of cancellation for dividing rounded numbers. The divisor 30 has 1 0, so we will cancel 1 0 in the divisor and the dividend. Step 3. This time, I will not use the long method, so I will just simply divide 6 divided by 3. So the answer is 2, then copy the remaining zeros, and that will give you an answer of 2. So the estimated quotient of 6,220 and 29 is 200. Now we have 6,867 divided by 46, where 6,867 is the dividend and 46 is the divisor. And we have to find the estimated quotient. Step 1 is to round off the dividend and the divisor to the highest place value 6 is in the highest place value to round it off check the digit to its right so if it is less than 5 or 0 to 4 the digit will remain the same or if it is 5 and above we will add 1 so the digit is 8 and it is above 5 therefore we will add 1 to the digit 6 so it will become 7 and all the digit to its right will be replaced with 0. Therefore, 6,867 rounded off to the highest place value is 7,000. So let's round off 46. 4 is the digit in the highest place value and the digit to its right is 6. So we will again add 1 to 4. So it will become 5 and the digit to its right will be replaced with 0. So 46 rounded off to the highest place value is 50. Step 2, apply the rules of cancellation for dividing rounded numbers. So the divisor 50 has 1 0. So we will cancel 1 0 to the divisor and the dividend. For step 3, divide the remaining numbers. So, we will gonna solve this using the long method. So, 700 divided by 5. 5 divided by 7 is 1. And then, 1 times 5 is 5. 7 minus 5 is equals to 2. Bring down 0. 20 divided by 5 is 4. Then, 4 times 5 is equals to 20. 20 minus 20 is equals to 0. Bring down 0. 0 divided by 5 is 0. Then 0 times 5 is equals to 0. 0 minus 0 is equals to 0. So the estimated quotient of 6,867 and 46 is 140. Now, it's your time to solve. In 5 minutes, find the estimated quotient of the given number. Your timer starts now.
Time's up! Let's check your work. The estimated quotient of 4,234 divided by 51 is 80. Number 2. The estimated quotient of 5,658 divided by 29 is 200. Number 3. The estimated quotient of 248 divided by 36 is 5. Number 4. The estimated quotient of 6,718 divided by 74 is 100. And number 5. The estimated quotient of 37,820 divided by 44 is 1,000. Did you get the correct answer? Good job! That's all for today. If you learned from this video, don't forget to enroll from my channel by hitting the subscribe button and the notification bell for more videos. Once again, this is your teacher Joy saying, ang lahat ng mahirap na math problems ay kaya nating padaliin. Bye-bye. Have a great day.